A few weeks ago, I decided it would be a good idea to be able to use an external microphone for any of my GoPro heroes. So I went on eBay and had a look around and found a cable that should do the job. I ordered it and it turned up. I plugged it in and silence. And this is why. If you have a look at this picture here, you'll see that there is no resistor between a couple of the pins. And that's what's needed to actually inform the uh, device that it's got a microphone attached. And now I'm going to show you how to make your own. Regardless of whether you have the Hero 3 or 4, they both have a microphone input on the USB socket and that's what we need to make a lead up for. So we purchased a USB plug via eBay. As you can see, it's really quite small. There's a matchstick there to compare the size of it, and also the 330K 0.125 watt or eighth watt resistor that you need to put across two of the pins. And here is a close up view of the plug that actually goes into the socket on the side of the camera with the uh, pin connections. So to make the cable up, you have to add the 330K resistor across pins 4 and 5. Next, you add wires to pins 6 and 7 for the left and right microphone input, and a wire to pin 5, which is the earth. You take that out to whatever socket you want to use, probably an inline 3.5mm stereo jack socket. Now, as my soldering wasn't that brilliant and the cables themselves were quite large, in fact too large for the supplied cable shell, I decided to encase them all in hot melt glue to protect them. Now, to do that, I covered the GoPro in duct tape to protect it and then just put hot melt glue around the cable assembly until it's set. And that actually is almost as good as potting compound and it provides a very good and secure way of holding the cables. And that's it. The cable assembly will work equally well for the Hero 3 or 4 range. And up in the top left here, you can see the actual pin outs needed to make the cable up. I really haven't shown you the soldering because anyone can solder. And I haven't given you an example of the audio because that's going to depend on what microphones you tend to use. And the fact that it works anyway, well, I don't need to prove it to you. There it is. Anyway, hope you found the information useful. If you did, please subscribe. Feel free to comment as well. But for now, bye for now.